Hello, everybody. <coughs> Welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. Where, let's not forget, we have a Gate Yankee egg in our pocket. I did give it to Lazelle because it's freaking heavy. Um, it's well be and done. I don't really know what to do with it. I, just, I, would, I would hope maybe she'd have more of an idea of what to do with it. I feel like we should, like, it shouldn't it be in an acid pool or something? What if I put it in an acid pool? Would it hatch? Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Onward. We have, we have like an acid. I don't think I have like an acid grenade. Never do. Granate and friggin. I need to up my constitution. What do I, I need to up my charisma. What am I doing? Oh, I really do for intelligence checks. I, I mean, I got it up. I remember I got it up from like a negative number, but. Because I dumped my deck stat. But. Oh, but I do have a plus three from Cloak of Protection and Aura of Protection? Really? Oh, for saving throws, not to check himself. Anyway, blah, blah, blah. I'm gonna go through my stuff. Oh my gosh, I love this. This is the brown alabaster dye. I was like, I don't really have like a black and gold or anything, but I, I was like, I wonder what brown will do. This looks amazing. Brown is an underrated color, to be honest. You can do some really, really beautiful things with like a nice deep brown or like a nice, like a really pretty tan, like. And I love it with the white. Oh, yes, yes. Oops, what am I doing? Uh, I could have gone with a red, but I am, I like this. Anyway, <laughs> I'm doing important things, I promise. Oh my gosh, I just did the brown alabaster dye on the armor. Oh, baby. I like that a lot. It kind of changes this part to like a blue. All right. All right. Beautiful. Beautiful. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it for the helmet, too, because the blue feather bothers me. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Oh, baby. The boots are fine. Can't really tell the boots. Oh, there's some blue. It's fine. We don't look too hard. We don't look too hard at the boots. I have holy water. Oh my gosh. I also apparently need to double check. I forget. I, I'm trying to put my potions in little pouches and my scrolls just to keep things from being crazy. So I need to remember to search those specifically. I hadn't really thought about it until just now, but the uh, the Githyanki uh, schism is in probably many ways, in, in some ways anyway, similar to the Drow schism, right? Where like uh, the Drow were, as far as I know, originally just like surface elves that were like coerced or like uh, seduced maybe to the Underdark by... Um, the Spider Queen is all that comes to mind. Uh, Lolf. I keep wanting to call her Lilith. Lolf. Um, but Lolf, like, lured or whatever, took people down into the Underdark and made them drow. Um, and then within the drow, though, after a while, there's, there's, there's like a new schism, essentially, right? Like, before it was like drow versus surface elves, but now the drow themselves within their own group are like, hey, uh, maybe not, that's not so cool. Maybe, you know, maybe the things Loth has been telling us aren't true. You know, like questioning the faith in their goddess, you know, like in, in her uh, cruel methods, you know, um, like questioning her why she's doing this, you know, and then splitting and becoming a Celadrin drow. Uh, but then you have the Lolf Drow still, too. So I think I am, like, my character is in a unique position to be able to appreciate the struggle. I mean, I you know, she's probably, like, a, like a second-generation Celadrin Drow, you know? Like, maybe she didn't, like, experience the Underdark necessarily for herself. But, um, like, in, like, under Lolf. But, uh, yeah. At least there, there would be, there would definitely be some sort of generational trauma there, you know. But this, I'm sorry, I'm just, I really am loving the like brown and white look. It's so good. It's so good. I'm gonna dye all my clothes in alabaster and brown. Like, oh my gosh. We agreed to bring the prism. Hey, prism, tell me what's up. She's like, don't listen to him. And I'm like, listen here, you. <laughs> if you aren't gonna tell me anything, I'm gonna listen to what other people say. You know what I'm saying? Uh, to free us from Blackett's tyranny. Blah, 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 blah. 
I'm stalling. Where shall we go? Can I go now to the dark? I think I should actually probably go to the Wraith when a player can't currently travel. Why can't a player currently travel? Do I want to? Oh, can I just leave? Is that what I'm supposed to do? This was a weird way to get. I usually you do leave, I guess, but like I don't know. I got like thrown into this without. I got thrown into the camp without going there. So now I'm all, I'm all ski wumpus. I'm gonna go play in the dark again. Get ready, guys. No more, no more happy times for us. No more, no more light. At least unless somebody tells me I need to go get the cobalt stuff. <laughs> Which I can always make an executive decision to not do, for the record. But if there's something super sick, but I just feel weird about, like ever since I killed the slavers without provocation, although they, I guess, and it's like, well, you killed the slavers and the kobolds are kind of like the slavers. And I'm like, nah, the Dwegar, 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 they made the choice to be nasty. Kobold are like semi, they're sentient, but not like totally, I think not at like the same, like brain processing level. I'm not saying it right, but let's see. I want to go. Yeah, I think I probably want to go. God, I gotta figure out what I am doing. I think I, I will switch out for Gale. Or not Gale. I will. I cannot. I keep those two mixed up 24-7. Um, when we get closer to Moonrise. Oh, no, what am I doing? I should go, I should go wake up the guy. Our Calais, where are we going? In the basement. Or not the basement, the last light in, rather. What's over there? Apparently that there's another... There's a, what, there's a whole other area behind... The inn that... Is outside the protection. I need to go over there also. <laughs> oh no, I'm in there. I'm like, this is not right. There's the oxen over here. Okay, behind this the stables. Oh, Roland's back. Let's see how I can muck up that conversation even more. Do I need to talk to you though? Something's on my mind. First cultists nearly murder us, and now we have a traitor on the inside. Can't we trust anyone? You can trust me. I'm a pallet, former paladin. I know. You've been there for us every step of the way. It's just all a bit much sometimes, you know? Yeah, get it out. Get it out, girl. All right, Roland, get your little sulky butt over here. Yes, yes, you saved me from shadow creatures. No need to gloat. I need you to take care of the children. I am absolutely going to gloat. Uh, I don't, he doesn't want to hear this from me, but uh, I came to check on you, that's all. I'm fine. It's Cal and Leah who need help. I hope they're alive. Uh. Let's see, was there? Kitty, oh, that's right, I should. Where is my? Any more, any more words, His Majesty? Oh, why? I didn't do it. Halson, I have found something. I pity you. <laughs> Daniel and me are oh. climbing up a tree. He keeps saying Daniel's name. He must know more. We need to rouse him. I found a loot. Seems to belong to the Flaming Fist. Good. Its music might help restore him. Show it to I'm him. not gonna play it. I... Carlac approves? I look ridiculous. I am not a musician by any stretch of the imagination. This guy's gonna wake up just to be like, stop 
ruining my loot. Daniel, he's still trapped there. He needs help. Calm, breathe. <laughs> You've been trapped in the shadow fell for a century. Take a moment to clear your mind. A century? You're Halsin. Thaniel said to find you. You must help him. Please. I will. But I need to know where Thaniel is. If I venture into the Shadowfell blind, I will never find him. I'm not sure I can put it into words. The landscape there shifts and changes. He has beautiful eyes. I love, I'm a, I'm a big fan of like the silvery gray eyes. Uh, I, should I just let Halsin in? I kinda, I kinda like, I, I feel like as like, it's not very main character energy of me maybe, but like letting other people who are better at things than you take the lead, I think is a, is a key, um, like, I don't know, I guess quality of, of a leader or just anybody, right? Like you gotta know when to take a step back and let other people do the talking, so. I'm interested. Let's let the house and handle this. Lavender. Whenever I saw Thaniel, I always smelled lavender. I can work with that. Rest. So now. you're gonna wander around looking for a Meet smell? Meet me by the lake shore. I have what we need to proceed, but I'll need your help. Be ready. This may prove perilous. Uh, okay. I am inspired. That's me. Um, where did I put it? Waking the sleeper. Yeah. Look at all these sage inspirations that I have. Aww. Um. Now I'm like, should I do that? Like. Thaniel will be so scared there alone. We looked after each other for such a long time. I hope he's all right. Mm, okay, now I gotta decide. But first I'm gonna go to the area behind the stable. Look at all these icons, like, blah, blah, there's so many people. And also this is, I thought they said there was something in the text condition thing that said that they condensed stuff like, like about certain conditions so that it wouldn't be this constant uh like stream of um up like like notification updates like this for things like this all right well let's f5 this and actually like zell is the best one for this objective noted ow well, we got two out of the three. I wasn't gonna waste an inspiration on that, though. All right. What now? Glad to see someone in this place got a proper burial. What? Where? Gra grave. Grave. Wheelbarrow. Grave. Grave. Open grave. Okay, this is a little cemetery back here. I'm also like, unless there's something crazy, I'm not gonna take it. What little people have when they're buried should uh, is, uh, maybe stay with them. I say that hot take, archaeologist. There's definitely uh, contingencies and whatnot to all of that, but come on up here. Something's here. Ooh, that's curious. Flaming fish. What? Someone beat her to a pulp. Am I finding a murder? I thought she was like flaming fist, like an expletive, you know? Huh. I'm reading the description on the Shield of Devotion, which inspires heart-fluttering bravery to this day. Local rumor, and on this one, local rumor claims a devil's tear gives these city militia shields their fire, much to the chagrin of the Parex blacksmith. She's got a whole chicken. I'm gonna, no, don't mind me. I will take this. I don't really have anybody who shields. Carlac and Lazelle I have as like two, or not I have as they are, two-handed weapon proficient. I'm the it's only one over. who does shields. And I don't know what to do with all of them. I have so many. Okay, well. That was it back here. I was thinking there was gonna be some shenanigans. Oh, what? Nope, there's a path. 
There is a path down here. <clears throat> yeah. Oh, it's, I was like, is this where Halston wants me to meet him? I think it is. Uh, well. Do we want to just lift the shadow curse right now? I almost wonder if that's like moving too fast, but it really would help us in the long run to have it lifted. I can't think of anything that we need to have the shadow curse for. All right, well, uh, since my wandering has brought me to the place where, well, where we're supposed to be for Halson, survival failed. That uh, might be worth it. Why is she freaking shadow heart? Me and freaking Karlak didn't get it. To increase your armor class to 16. Let's give that to, what? I, I used, used to be able to just pick up and send stuff to the, to everybody. Maybe I can't because they're... Because it's in a box? Yeah, what? You used to be able to send... Like, why did they change that? I liked being able to send stuff to everybody from wherever I was. Okay, well, that's stupid. Now you can only do that in camp, I guess? I don't like that. Alright, Allison. <laughs> Why are we next to this fairy ring looking place? You're here. Good. Now we can begin. Uh, yeah, uh, I want to know what to expect. Thaniel is trapped in the shadow fell. But thanks to your efforts, I know where to look. Now I must go there. Alone. Oh, so he does know where the lavender is. Yeah, but this is not fair. It is kind of cool that other people have, like, their arcs and stuff, though. Like like how uh, Annabelle, I think is her name, right? Uh, Annabeth? Annabelle? Um, the little girl, little tiefling girl in our camp. Like, she's going to be going off on this, like, she's... It seems like, anyway, she's going she's gonna to be going off on this massive story on her own, right? And then uh, Halson's going to have his own thing to do. But it is kind of like, but, what? I want to see, too, you know? <laughs> Shouldn't I come with you? No. Okay. This opportunity has been a hundred years in the making. It has to be me. And only me. <laughs> I'm like, but... But I didn't bring you here to witness an old druid's grandstanding. You have a part to play in this. And I trust you will play it well. With the Oak Father's blessing, I can infiltrate the Shadowfell. But doing so Ooh. will sap my strength. I'll need your help if I'm to return. Ooh. I need you to stay here. Okay. Keep the portal open until I return. And defend it at all costs. Okay, that's something. That's something to do. Listen, I'm not gonna be like, I'll come with you. Like, he's already, he's very adamant that he needs to do this himself. And he needs somebody to watch his back, a.k.a. his exit. Um... And it's like, oh, what do you mean? Like, this is... I'm not necessarily... There are things, there are times I have questions, but there are times where, like, I feel like at least a paladin, even a former paladin, is like, look, I, I get you. Like, you know, like, you're militaristic. I'm not necess I'm not a nerd, necessarily. I'm only a little bit of a nerd. <laughs> so, you can count on me. Good. Now, it's important that only I pass through the portal once okay. it opens. Okay. The magic is fragile. Any mistake, and our one chance will be lost forever. Hard save, hard save, hard save. <laughs> it took me years of study. Of seeking the Oak Father's favor. To find a way to part the veil. Pray that this works. If I have any prayers Oak left Father, in me, they're yours. Hear me. Aid me. Force open the jaws of darkness. Make passage for your vessel of light. Oh, she's probably jelly. It's ready. I'll return with Thaniel as soon as possible. Stay close to the portal. Buy me what time you can. Oh, this is so intense. Alison, good luck. Also, what if one of my people accidentally goes in? Okay, here's the other thing is that I don't know if this actually pauses the game at all when you do this because stuff, yep, stuff still moves. Um, the big thing was defend, right? He's like, you need to defend. Although, theoretically, I could just hop on in. Mm, is it, that's kind of crazy, honestly. And like, I would maybe mess things up, but uh, you could just like hop in and like try to mess with things. Or not even, like you just try to help, you know? You could mess things up by doing that. I, 
I can see invisibility. Aura of vile oblivion. I still have auras up too. So there. Oh, we got the undead. Well, they're shadow cursed. What, are these? Are they attacking the portal itself? Oh, they are. It has a health bar. Soul breaker. Oh my gosh, that is real sick. Actually, but first, I want to see. It looks like I should be able to get to them and make them all scaredy cats. Yes. Turned and damage. Oh, I think if they take damage, they unturn. So, victory will awaits. not mess with them. And this is a cool thing, a uh, soul breaker. Um, but does it work against things that don't have a soul? <laughs> Are you immune to stun? Ooh, I guess I could, we could cast light on, oh yeah. Carlite could cast light on her stuff. I think that's been undone. Um, okay, this does seem excessive and it does require a short rest. I won't use it right now. Oh, a wraith. We have shadows. And we have a wraith. What do you do? Oh, you're technically undead too? I didn't realize the wraiths were undead. Oh, the shadow mastiff was uh, too far away. Me, actually. It will create difficult terrain and attack and smother creatures within. I don't want to attack these guys. I think, ooh, ooh, there's stuff in there. Ha ha, okay. I didn't even know they were there. Here goes but I nothing. do want to block off that approach. At least make it harder for them to get through. Concentration spell. The ravens are easy though. If I just do, oh my gosh, what is it? Okay, wow, it's okay. We got to do some AOE stuff pronto. I don't really have AOE stuff. <laughs> no. <laughs> I got a bunch of girl boss, girl fight nerds. Oh boy. Oh! Did the doggy get behind me? Did somebody get behind me? I need to move up there. Yeah, these guys are still turned. Nice! Oh my gosh, I'm so good at the video game. No, just kidding. I suck at the video game. <laughs> Walk into these guys. Okay. Oh! Lazelle is inspired by Pentacrush? I mean, I killed like five enemies? Is that what it was? Kill five enemies in a single turn. Okay. <laughs> Luckily, they were all one uh, health ravens, so. I could, I could frighten enemies if then they get closer. We'll break, dang it, okay. We'll break, I'm bad at this. Um, dang, everything I wanna do will break. <laughs> All my stuff's concentration. Okay, yeah, I definitely put the AOE on a good spot. So far, nothing else is coming from over here. Oh, well, I say that, and the freaking, no, the birdies, not, no! <gasps> I gotta go over there. Uh, let's hellish rebuke. Uh, oh my gosh, it has like one health left. Some must have fallen to the curse. Shadow get Yankee, I know she's like, oh, someone must have fallen to the curse. Yeah, oh my gosh. Oh my god, I think those are Dwager? Like, how did I go? Oh my gosh, stop, 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 stop. Oh no. There's so many. Three turns is gonna be an eternity with all these people. Can we move on now? Is this, are we good? Okay. 
actually going to do this because they can't make ranged attacks in or out of it with this scroll. With, um, Lazel. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. I get it. I did not think I was going to have to move for that, but apparently I am. Well, I'm going to attempt, well, to turn undead and all in this vicinity. At the very least, we did a bunch of damage, so... I think I need to move away from the ones... From some of these so that they don't take damage. Because if they're turned... Yeah, they just try to escape. Are you immune to frighten? I don't have, like, an AoE attack that I can do besides this. Okay, they are frightened. We good? Everybody? It's gotta go through like a... Three turns feels like an age. This feels like an age, honestly. No, what? They're still attacking it? Okay, that was not at all what I wanted, at all, by any freaking, I, I, ah, man. I think I have, do I have a cleave of some sort? I don't know, this is bad, actually. I might need to actually send um, Shadowheart over here, like pronto. And one of these two, I can't have two people over here. Just have to buy him a little more time. Yeah, other than here, Rebecca. Okay, we're gonna keep. I'm ready. And I think I'll probably, honestly, just have Shadowheart chill up here. Anything. She's like the ideal last defense. Because anything that comes up is gonna get. Gonna get hit by her, yeah, and show up at the very least, you know? Okay. And I was leaving that guy there because, like, he, if he was gonna walk into her, he was probably gonna die, so. Honestly, I'm a genius. This has saved our bacon. And this was nice. This was good, too. They, they, couldn't, they couldn't fire out of it. But... We good? We did good? It's done. Okay. I have Oh my gosh, look, he, he does have him. Dang. He did it. He did it! Oh, this is awesome. Oh, poor little but forest something's boy. Wrong. Dreadfully wrong. Well, yeah. No. It can't be. Uh, we need to get him somewhere safe. Yes. I'll bring him back to camp. He'll be safest with us. He's not dead. I need to examine him. I need to understand what's wrong. It's almost like something's missing from Gee, him. Gee, I wonder if that little boy... Come see us when you can. ...who's the only other person that's talked about Daniel knows anything. Crazy. <laughs> little boy, wherefore aren't you? Carlite got inspired by... Oh! Lizelle was inspired too! Let's see... Anybody else? Lift the shadow curse. Okay, so it wasn't as easy as... I was like, are we just gonna lift the curse? Apparently not. Um, one for the to survive in a fight in which you kill ten or more enemies. Sick. Okay, sick. And... Wait, no, it wasn't. It, it was Carlag. Protect Halson's portal while he saves the spirit of the land. Going on his own quest over there. Marching. We did it. Well, hold on. Now we got. Okay. Well, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and call this one here because it's probably been a long time. But I am gonna go around and loot everybody um, afterwards. But um, thank you all for joining me. I appreciate it. This was exciting. Oh, actually, before I go, we will. 
Okay, so Allison rescued Daniel from the Shadow Cove, but the spirit of the land is ill. If you want to help, we should speak to Allison. We should speak to that little boy, is what we should do. We can find him. I think that was it. I kept seeing stuff, like, pop up, and I wasn't sure... If there was anything else. Oh, yay! Destroy the ancient tome. Along with any dark secrets. Good riddance. Rob, rob, rob. We'll see. I'm excited to see how it's going to work out in my other game. Maybe, maybe, what's his name? Art can figure something else out for why Thaniel is ill. Okay, cool. Yes, I will go ahead and call it now. So thank you all so much for joining me. I appreciate it. Really quick, I want to say thank you to my patrons, to all my patrons, including my Accords here patrons. Thank you so much, Fane, for your support. I very much appreciate it. And I want to give an extra special shout out to Reese Galito, my sapling tier patron. Thank you so much for your support. I very much appreciate it as well. And I want to give an extra, extra special shout out to Christopher, my forest tier patron. who's one above and beyond and has supported me in the channel. And who I truly cannot thank enough. So thank you all again for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one.